I mean, I'm, I'm glad the people are out here. We the people are out here because we're outraged. But the system, what about the system? You know, the system's so, so broken that it just allows these things to go on. Yeah. You know, um, as I said, it's, it's the height of immorality. I just don't know how else to describe it. Okay. You know, people losing their homes. Anybody losing their homes. It shouldn't be allowed. It should not be happening at all. Yeah. People should not be allowed to lose their homes in this country. You know, the hell with profits and banks and all those people. Are there some other um, actions coming up that you're organizing? Yes. I'm helping to organize an action next Wednesday. A week from today at noon at 18th that would and be Castro. December 19th December 19th at noon 18th and Castro in front of the Christmas tree we're going to be doing um, a protest of the Ellis Act because at the same time that people are being foreclosed in San Francisco a lot of tenants are losing their homes because of Ellis Act there's a mm -hmm. spike in Ellis Act evictions happening um, in f at least three neighborhoods that we know of the Castro Admission and North Beach Chinatown so tenants from all three of those neighborhoods are going to converge into Castro and they're going to tell their stories. And we're calling it Happy Holidays, Now Get the Hell Out. Okay. Because that's basically what's happening. That's People are being yeah. thrown out. People are being thrown December out of homes for the holidays. Oh. Uh -huh. so, and, and we're also going to be calling upon um, our local politicians to do something. You know, stop this. Give yeah. us more protections. Get the hell out is what the banks are saying yes. to our folks? Well, it's what the landlords and speculators. Because oh, um, totally the Ellis Act evictions, a lot of them being done by real estate speculators because they want to create TICs and flip buildings and make tons of money. Mm -hmm. And the people who are being evicted, we have um, um, four households in the Castro. Three of them have disabled people in them. Mm -hmm. Two of them have house, are households with people with AIDS. So these are the most, mo most vulnerable people that mm -hmm. are being thrown out by these Ellis Act evictions, and it's all about profits. It's like it's like this, you know, it's all about profits, it's all about money, it's, and they don't care about people's lives or people's housing. So we're gonna be gathering in the Castro and we're gonna be sending a message to the city and to Scott Wiener, who has sponsored legislation to allow up to 2,000 TICs to instantly condo convert, no, to nice. bypass the um, condo conversion process. Mm -hmm. and decorations for the Christmas tree that look like decorations but have a message. Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> That's an idea. Uh, I, I will mention that to people. <laughs> but, okay. So people should come out and support and support the tenants on the next Wednesday, December 19th, 12 noon in front of the Christmas tree at 18th and Castro. Oh, okay. Thanks. Flyers at the Action Council.